Good morning, people. Hope you are doing well, having a good day so far. Sunday, the 3rd of January for you guys. It's the first day of the year. It's the 1st of January. It's currently about 10 past 7. I'm about to head into the gym. And I just wanted to talk about this subject quickly because I think it's super important. And it's one of the things I know is going to make me a lot of money this year. And it's something that you guys can implement. Maybe it's directly with what I'm going to talk about or it's something else. What I wanted to talk about is pairing habits, right? And this one particular habit habit is something I know is going to save me so much time this year and therefore make me a lot more money because I'm going to be able to spend the time I save doing this habit or pairing these two habits, replacing that time, producing more income for my business. This is a pretty weird habit. Not necessarily a weird habit, but it's something you would seriously overlook. So I'm big into the gym. I try and get the gym session out pretty much first thing in the morning. I've just done an hour of outreach. That's sort of my number one priority at the moment is uh, generating business. I get that thing done first thing and then I move straight to the gym, get my gym session out of the way. And something I, I used to do was I would go to the gym and then I'd always go home and shower, right? And it sounds silly as you'd be like, yeah, cool, what's wrong with that? Something I've been doing recently is making sure that I shower at the gym. You'd be surprised the amount of time that that actually saves because if you go to the gym, you train for an hour, you have to drive back to, to home or you know whether you get a bus, you get a train, but you're spending that time traveling back home and then when you get home you then having to jump in the shower it takes a lot of time essentially right and just by simply implementing the fact of showering at the gym you're gonna be saving so much time it sounds silly and even me talking about it now I think oh my god like it, it sounds ridiculous however when I started doing this I started to save so much time genuinely at least half an hour to 45 minutes in my day because I would go back home and then I would like sort of like like ponder like I, I wouldn't get straight in the shower put it that way but now when I finish my gym session I get straight in the shower one other thing that I've started to do is started to shave at the gym which same again sounds ridiculous but if you're a guy if you're a man one thing I pride myself on is is being clean shaven right because it all comes down to you know that person you want to be and obviously I know for a fact especially my bald head I didn't call you baldy, baldy. and it makes me feel like the person I need to be clean shaven a lot better in myself when I'm clean shaven I'm looking looking respectable I'm looking like the person I know I need to be even doing that shaving at the gym it just means that I'm not shaving at home it also means that I'm saving an extra half an hour from being at home so put it this way I'm showering and shaving at the gym every single day now shaving every other day depends but yeah I'd say shaving pretty much every single day it really got me thinking about habits and what you need to do and these simple little changes that if you just change this little habit then change this little habit then change this little habit if you could do that change one habit every single month for one habit every other month and just focus on that one thing you're going to be saving so much time and you're going to be becoming that person that you need to be another thing when i'm thinking about going to the gym is my face is kind of tingling now and i might be speaking a little bit quicker than i usually do and that's because before i left for the gym i took two scoops of pre-workout and that also got me thinking about habits routines cues and stuff like that and it's like people say to me like Ollie you're, you're nuts going to the gym so early and to be honest like 20 past 7 that's that's not really early for me anymore because I've built that habit pre-workout right whether you like pre-workout you don't there's subconscious meaning behind pre-workout for me now of like if I'm indoors and I'm ready to go to the gym or I'm not fancy and going to the gym and I take that pre-workout there's no way I'm not gonna not go to the gym if I've just taken a scoop of pre-workout because like I said my face is tingling that's start probably getting the jitters a little bit and I'm ready to go to the gym but same again it's just a cue it's just a cue for that habit of me going to the gym so when I take the pre-work and my face starts to tingle I'm like I need to work out so find stuff within your life or little things that you can include for you to save time generate energy and raise necessity I hope that video helped let me know if you want me to do like more videos like this of me just sort of sitting talking to a camera about certain topics rather than all your fancy edits and stuff like that because obviously I'll be doing videos like that but sometimes I think it's necessary for me to just come in talk about certain subjects so thank you guys for watching if you did find this video interesting go check out this video I talk about why I will be in the best shape of my life in 2022 and I go a little bit more in depth into training habits routines and everything like that so hope you enjoyed it I'll see you in this video have a good day and have a good 2022 let's go people let's go